Hi guys, so um, I was playing around earlier and uh, decided to use an old hard drive that had uh, packed up and uh, stick some wet and dry paper to it and make a grinder out of it. Um, I've put an extra platter in there, CD platter. Um, basically, just got totally gutted it. Um, put two discs in it from another drive. Um, I tried it out and it worked really well. Um, I'm using uh, this to drive it. It's uh, one of the motors, motors uh, drivers, the brushless. Um, just thinking. What I've also done, had to do with this, um, I've added a, a small heat sink to the chip that drives this because uh, at 12 volt for some reason it, it just gets really hot. I've also put some um, diodes across and also added this fan as well to keep this cool. Because obviously the amount of power it uh, it draws. I'll connect this up. I've also added some pin edges to the back here as well, just so I'm going to connect straight up to it. Um, the setup for this it's just obviously the first one there, so basically in order. It also drives a four pin as well. It's got the common for the four pin. This is just the three pin one. This. So. Let's connect this up. I literally just, uh, yeah, you used uh, super glue for sticking the uh, thing to the actual, you know, the aluminium platter inside and it stuck really well. Um, so hopefully, let's get up to speed. I really like this motor drive because you can drive these motors really hard. Just, uh, Cuts really well, look. So, another way to use a hard drive rather than throwing away when the uh, pack up. Just thought I'd show you that. I've also tried it with the wet, the you know, wet in it as well. And uh, like I say, this one works out rather well. It had a, a little, like an out foil just here. I just pulled that out. So. Should I, you know, use it in something and make something up for it, then uh, I can quite simply just, you know, when the water's in there, you see it's a trickle down there, so it's like a natural drain for it. Um, like I say, taking a part's quite simple. You just take all the screws out and pull everything out, and you get some neodymium magnets as well. Oh, yeah, this spins pretty fast, like more than what it's recommended. Um, anyway, I hope you find that useful for... If you want a grinder, I mean, I know, I don't know why I wanted one, but uh, does it really well. It's a nice clean cut though. Coming useful this. Glad I made it. Thanks for watching.